The term ore refers to a naturally occurring rock containing metal or metal compounds. It is mined when there's enough metal to extract profitably. In essence, it must be mined at a profit. Mines don't contain pure gold, silver, or other metals. Instead, they hold ore, rocks with a mixture of minerals. Extracting these metals from ore is often a lengthy and complex process. The profitability of mining varies. Iron ore requires a 20 to 30% concentration. However, for copper, only a 0.5% concentration is needed. For gold, even tiny concentrations, often just a few grams per ton of rock, can be mined profitably because of its high value. According to Wikipedia, R is natural rock or sediment that contains one or more valuable minerals concentrated above background levels, typically containing metals that can be mined, treated, and sold at a profit. Deposits are accumulations of ores. We often name them by location, like South Africa's Witwatersrand Gold Deposit. Some are named after discoverers or prominent figures, such as the Henderson Molybdenum deposit in Colorado, named after its discoverer, James Henderson. Metals represent an important part of raw material trade because our distribution globally is uneven. For example, in Australia, there is iron ore in abundance, while in Switzerland, there is none at all. The London Metal Exchange is the primary global hub for trading common metals like copper, aluminum, and zinc. TOCOM, in Japan, the New York Mercantile Exchange, in the United States, and the Shanghai Futures Exchange, in China, also trade base metals, but at smaller volumes. Big companies set benchmark prices for commodities like iron or quarterly. For many commodities, there's no benchmark price. This means prices are negotiated on a case-by-case -case basis. Some examples include lithium and rare earths. Ores are essential for our modern world. Their value, extraction, and trade have both economic and global implications. As technology advances, the demand for these resources will likely increase, emphasizing the importance of sustainable mining practices.